Hey YouTube, Camper Van Kevin here. Well today, not in Montrose, I'm in Wyoming. What am I doing here? Well, I told you I wasn't going to stay long. As soon as I got these walls up, got the bed back in, time to move. Show you yep. where I'm at. Boondocked at Walmart last night. We've got something I want to show you right quick. Oh, he's pulling off and leaving. Have you ever seen a travel trailer transported that way? He's about to take off the back of that Cherokee. First time I've ever seen anything like that. What about you guys? There were a ton of RVs parked here last night, but they were all being delivered, it seemed to me. So there must be a hub around here. Well, morning, Tucker. Morning, Dad. Morning, baby May May. Hey, Daddy, I'm cold. Well, it is breezy. Okay, my seatbelt thing's a ring a ling -ing. Gas 289. Let's go get us some. I'm at about half a tank. Look at this little sucker right here. It looks like a boat. A little snoozy. If I could make it stop ringing, I would do it. And hold the phone too. A little snoozy. A little clamshell. That sucker's not going to leak. I think that's the point. There's no air conditioner on top. It's in the back. Got to get some gasoline. Hey, Dad, where are we headed anyways? We're going to meet up with some friends. Whoa. That's all I had to do to make it stop was put it in dry, in a park. Your mustache is all out of whack, Tuck. Your mustache is all messed up. Morning, Martini. Morning, Dad. I didn't sleep too good. I got cold. Well, I got us a new blanket. Maybe tomorrow night will we'll be warmer. Let's get some gasoline. Had to buy me a hoodie at Walmart. Put that sucker on when I get gas. See that little snoozy right there? Air conditioner's in the back. I zoom in. Can't leak. Not off the top anyway. What we got? 289 unleaded, 314, 339. I have to admit I have a problem. When I travel, I don't eat that good. Yesterday, I'm eating at McDonald's this morning. Yesterday I stopped and I got a bacon egg cheese biscuit. $4.00 thing was about that big around. That and a coffee and a little sausage biscuit, seven bucks. Had to get the baby something. You know, I'm always saying, you know, people are always like, Kevin, you got it all figured out. RVing and living full time on the road. But what if I'm wrong? Just saying. McDonald's. Ugh. Two sausage egg, two sausage biscuits and a coffee, about three bucks. Ooh, look at that pretty sucker go right there. Mm. Oh, Winnebago. You park it. You find a place to park, not me. There's my buddy Craig and Miss Sandra. They come up to uh, where I was staying at uh, yesterday in Montrose and said, We're headed to Yellowstone. You want to go? I said, Yeah. Give me 30 minutes. So we're on the road. Tucker, you think you're going to get some of my biscuit, don't you? Who else puts ketchup on their uh, sausage biscuits? I do. I like it. Man, I like I like ketchup on, on sausage. I figured you'd say that. Martini gets a bite. Thank you, Daddy. Baby May May gets a bite. 
Mm -mm, thank you, Daddy. And Tucker gets a bite. Oh, man. Thank you. You betcha, Tucker. You're always so polite. Not a whole lot going on here in Wyoming. A little road construction. Oh, look at that beautiful bumper sticker. How about that? Well, we made it to Landler, Wyoming on our way to Yellowstone. Stopped at a museum of the American West. It's about 55 degrees here. Went through some desolate country to get here, that's for sure. Got the ProMaster parked up here. I didn't get the babies out yet. Well, they've created a little town here. A little tourist trap. I'm gonna tell you something. There's something that I never want to be on YouTube. I don't want to be a tourist guy. I might take you with me into some neat places, but that's just not who I am. I might show you some great places, but I just want to vlog about my life. Not necessarily about where I go. It's about my relationships with people. And my little dogs. Isn't that right, Martini? You got that right, Daddy. Isn't that right, Tucker? Yeah, man. You know what you're talking about. Where's the baby May Mays at? Oh, I see her over there. But, uh, yep, gonna meet up with some friends in uh, Yellowstone. I've never been to Wyoming before. Ooh, a windmill. If you guys have watched my channel for any amount of time, you know I love windmills. I believe that's a little Air Motor Chicago. I can't read it. Maybe I can come back and look at this again on film. And zoom in on it. I grew up, my daddy had a windmill in our yard. We used it to uh, draw water out of a well. It was a backup system to water our chicken houses in case we ever lost power. Watched my brothers help put it up when I was about four years old. Kind of made a big impact on my life. Reminds me of home. No shortage of teepees. And I guess every Indian village had some metal art what I'm thinking. Yep, windmill kind of makes me feel right at home. Feels good to stretch my legs. There's that baby May May. Baby May May, why are you so shy? I, I don't know, I just am. I bet you guys like to stretch your legs too, huh? Man, you know it. Tucker, you need to check your p mail while you can, while we stopped. Yep. Anybody you know? Nope, never smelled them before. It's Martini's turn. Stretch your legs, baby. We gotta get going. I gotta get that baby May May walk, too. Okay, it's baby May May's turn. Baby May May. Did you know I, was caught, I caught a lot of flack on that video I just put out when I put those walls in the little RV? They say, no wolf pack. So we want another video with lots of wolf pack. My buddy Craig there. So let's let you potty, okay? Oh, goodness. I had made another video. I went back to River Bottom Park in Montrose. I was working on it last night. I worked on it for three hours. 
I just didn't like it. I got mad, erased all my footage, and erased all of my edits. But uh, the babies have found a way to get on the bed. Maybe I'll share it with you this video or next. You gotta get on the road, put some miles on. Sometimes they're just things that take your breath away. We are headed to Yellowstone and we've seen some pretty mountains. And then we saw this. We'll find a place to pull over here and show it to you. It's the end of August, 2018. And look at the snow up here. My, oh my. How beautiful is that? Now that's a sight to see. That'll take your breath away. Headed into Yellowstone. There's, just, there's something you don't see every day. There's a lady walking with a water bottle on her head. Yeah, I see the screen kind of bounce up. Fully zoomed. How about that? We're inside the park. I'm gonna pull in here to the general store and get some groceries. Got my refrigerator going. My Dometic. It's the time to fill it up. Well, the groceries wasn't that expensive. A little general store. Prices were about right. Tucker, get out of my yogurt. This is not where the refrigerator is going to go. But I had to plug it up. I'm going to hook it up to one of the batteries to get it through the night. Then I'll hook up the solar. No, no. It is rough moving in here and everything not being quite ready. But everything's here and I can make it work. A few more little groceries. And then we'll go to the campsite. Some hot springs. We gotta get to the campsite. It's called the Biscuit Basin. Never saw anything like that before. Well, we made it to the campsite. Good thing that we called ahead to get it. I have zero cell phone service. Here's the campground.
that wood teardrop right there. How beautiful is that? Ooh. Man, that's a pretty camper. Not a great job. Dogs are huge. They eat you. They eat you. Yeah. They'll bite you in two, Tucker. Man, I'll bite them. I'll bite them. You'll see. Yeah, I'll be taking you to the vet, too. We'll be camping just a minute, babies. Well, this looks like us. <clears throat> Mr. Craig and Miss Sandra, me and the wolf pack. We made it. Okay. Well, I'm going to end this little video right here. Yesterday morning, I had no idea. I was going to go to Yellowstone. So, I don't know what I'm going to show you here. We're just going to have a good time and enjoy ourselves. I'll show you some of the things that I see. So, I appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you guys so much for watching my videos. Hey, we'll see you again soon. You guys take care. Bye-bye.